What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Smooth, and you already know what's happening. The best chef, another banger. As you see by the title, it's another lit video. And today, in this video, PS4 playing in the background. I don't know if y'all can hear that or not. But in this video, we're gonna be talking about we're gonna be talking about beard growth, and we'll be talking about important things to know about on your beard journey. You know what I'm saying? Things to keep you going, and just stuff to keep you motivated. Cause a lot of times in my video, I always say, man, stay consistent. You know what I'm saying? Don't cut your beard. Stay just stay, just enjoy the embrace the grind. That's why I say. But I never tell y'all like things to keep y'all motivated and things to keep y'all going. And you know what I'm saying? So that's what we're gonna talk about in this video. Make sure y'all stay tuned. Before we jump into it, leave a like for your boy. You know what I'm saying? Comment what you want to see next. Any question you got about beard growth or anything, let me know in the comment section. If you want to check out any of my products, the beardedones.com. If you got any questions, let me know in the comment section. Beard brush, keep it on me everywhere I go. You feel me? Uh, subscribe to the channel, give me the 10k, but enough talking, let's jump right into the video, for sure. Alright, first thing first, you know what I'm saying, I was just sitting here chilling, and I was just thinking like, I was watching some video on YouTube, and he was just talking about, basically like, how to keep going on YouTube, how to stay consistent. And I was like, bro, I got a beard channel, and I be telling everybody about their beard journey, and you know, it's, it's been a lot of tough times, it's definitely, it's been times where I gave up, like, just being 100 with y'all, I gave up and cut my beard. Like, it's like my third time growing it out, so... I'm just gonna give y'all some words of encouragement and some tips and some things to keep y'all going. So tip number one, first thing first, don't get down on yourself because no matter what you see, and a lot of times you seeing other people, like you seeing me, people on your Instagram, celebrities, different stuff, your friends maybe, they might have big, thick beards and you might be like, bro, why can't my beard get like that? Or dang, my junk not look like that. And that's like the worst thing to do. Never compare yourself. Never compare yourself or compare your journey to anybody else because we all different. So basically that's, with that being said, just realize what you got and work with what you got because you never know your jump might start off. Your beard might start off. Your beard might start off patchy or something. But then it's like. What's up? But yeah though, don't compare your beard to nobody else because everybody different. You know what I'm saying? Your game is different than anybody else's games. Work with what you got, because you never know, like. I know y'all seen the little um I know y'all seen the little picture and stuff. It was like, it was like a carrot. It was like two carrots, and one one carrot, you know what I'm saying, had a big old, like a big old stem coming out the ground. The other one had a little bitty stem. But underneath the ground, the carrot, the uh, the small carrot was huge, you know what I'm saying, it was this big. But the one with the stems was really this big, you know what I'm saying, underground. So in the end, when the dude pulled his up with the small little stems coming out of the ground to where he couldn't see, his, his carrot was huge and he had a lot to eat off of. That's basically the same thing that I'm saying. Like, if you know what I'm talking about, hopefully I can find a picture on Google. I put it on here. If you know what I'm talking about, that's the same approach you got to have with your beard and just life in general because don't compare yourself to nobody else because you don't know the end result of what you can what you can possibly get out of it. You know what I'm saying? So that's tip number one. Just always stay confident in your grind, your whatever. Tip number two, realize it's a journey and realize that any journey you take, anything you do in life, whether it's a beard journey, whether it's a weight loss journey, anything you do is just preparing you for the next thing in life, the next step. So I relate that to a lot because when I started my beard journey, like I told y'all, I don't cut my junk three times, but it's going to taught me patience. And that's going to help me out with YouTube, help me out with music, business, everything in life. Because I was like, man, I don't, if I just gave up on my beard, there's a thought process I had. I was like, man, if I gave up my beard like two years ago, I would have never had this YouTube. I would have never probably started my business. I would have never had no beard if I just gave up, but I stayed going, you know? I might have, a couple times I might have cut it, but I kept coming back like, bro, you know what? I'm gonna stay true to it. That's the same thing. It's like, stay true to the grind. Cause it might, even like, even in the future, even if you never can grow a full beard, at least you can know like, bro, I can really dedicate myself to something. And it might lead you to the next, big thing in your life you know what i'm saying so just the whole process of you staying humble and staying down with yourself it's gonna teach you a lot and it's gonna help you out in life because i'm telling y'all like it's just this one thing and i can relate this like minus the beer so i can like i told you i can relate this to my business like a couple of times it's been a lot of times where especially at the beginning i was getting no sales i was ordering a lot of products you know what i'm saying in debt a lot but i just kept i stayed i was like bro you know if i give up on this now i don't know what the future is gonna be like so there's no point in me giving up i might as well keep on going hard with it that's the same thing that's the same approach that you got to take with anything and with everything so that's tip number two tip number tip number three is stay positive because for one being positive is going to help your beard journey it's going to help everything it's going to help your health and everything in general so you know you might wake up and look in the mirror and might and you might not like start looking at start looking at it as the as half full rather than half empty look at use that analogy because like 
look at your beard like dang i can see this hair growing so tomorrow my two more might be coming on my face use that don't use like dang bro my beard is still patchy i'm still this and that because you're going to talk yourself down and talk you're going to talk yourself into cutting your junk like i made a video a couple days i was like i was just looking at my beard i was in the same spot i was looking at my beard in the mirror i was like i'm gonna cut my beard because it's so low you know what i'm saying i was like bro it's so stupid and i had a lot of, see that's why i'm thankful for y'all too i had a lot of comments people saying bro don't cut your beard just stick it out just to grind it out and now like it's only been a couple more days and i can already see like it's hard to tell right here but y'all can see like the hair coming in so i'm just gonna wait and let them line it up and it's just like that's just the same thing it's like man look at it halfway full do not look at it half empty because you don't really talk because your mind powerful it's free your mind's stupid powerful you really would talk yourself into just stopping everything now if you don't did a weight loss journey or anything you probably know exactly what i'm talking about because you probably go in the mirror look at your abs whatever and be like man i've been working out for a whole week i don't see nothing and you talk yourself right out of keep grinding you never know you might be two weeks away from having an eight pack so it's just like that's just the thing with life it's like you're crazy it's crazy because our mind's so powerful and it affects how you think, how we feel, how we move, and everything. So just you being positive could be the could be the breaker, deal breaker between between ah, you being positive could be the deal breaker between you growing a beard and you having a patchy beard. Just because. Because for one, like I was saying, it affects your attitude. So you wake it up, if you positive, you automatically gonna be more happy and we wanna work out, wanna do more stuff that's gonna naturally just help your beard grow. But if you negative and you always thinking like, dang, but my beard patchy, oh, I can't grow no beard, oh why it's taking so long, then you're gonna always give up on yourself. Same thing with life. Like I'm telling y'all, these journeys, like pay attention to everything you do. Don't just think of it like it's a beer journey that's failed, a weight loss journey that failed. Don't think of it like that. Think of it as something that you're experiencing trying to better yourself in life because it's going to take you farther and farther to different heights of life in general. Also, okay, that's that, that's it for that tip. Another tip is, man, take before pictures and after pictures. Make sure you're taking pictures of yourself because that's going to keep you motivated too because you never know because it's the same thing. Like I can say, the reason why I can comp keep comparing weight loss journey because I've been, that's two journeys that I really don't been on and succeeded so far because it's like, and I would take pictures of myself daily because if you don't, you're not going to really notice. It's hard to notice stuff about yourself. So if you don't have that reference, you going back and see how much, how far you don't came, it's going to seem like you're not really that much because you stay looking at yourself. So it's hard to see every little detail. So take them before pictures, take a picture like every week or something. Keep yourself motivated, give yourself goals. Cause if you don't give yourself goals, it's hard for you to keep going. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I don't know if any of y'all play Call of Duty. Like imagine if every level, imagine if you never can prestige, imagine if you never can prestige or you never unlock new guns at a different level. You wouldn't care to play. You were like, bro, what's the point of me playing this if I ain't unlocking that? So just like write goals for yourself and like keep goals for yourself. Like keep pictures every, I say every three weeks, take a picture. Or every two weeks, every month, take a picture of yourself. And then have a picture of like somebody like when I was growing my beard at first, I was like, bro, my beard like Odell. So I have a picture of Odell, or whatever. No homo, bro. Just this some real tips. I had a picture of Odell and I was like, bro, I want my beard to get this how I want my beard. So every day I would work towards that and I was like, man, okay, this one I'm at now. But I and even when I was, used to have patchy, my beard was patchy. But beforehand it was even more patchy. But I started seeing the progress. And I was like, man, I can't give up now because I don't know what my job will be like in a year or two years. My job might be sitting like this. I might be comparing my job to Rick Ross. So just keep doing little positive notes, set goals. But this video not gonna be too long. That's it for the video. Hopefully y'all got something out of this. Hopefully it change y'all mindset and make y'all keep going and motivate y'all to get started with y'all beard journey. Now it's never too late to start your beard journey. Start today, man. Get y'all beard products. Go to the description, thebeardedones.com. All products, all natural products, beard growth, man. Look, my beard is so it's thicker right now. And it's real. I use all my products. Look, no cap. I use all my products, bro. Like I'm not at home right now, as y'all can see, and I keep them with me. The oil is fun size, so you can throw it in your bag. Keep it with me, bro. I, I don't, I'm don't. i not capping. I'm not just selling this. I really use this. I really do this. So get y'all products, man. Start y'all bear journey. Good luck to y'all. Let me know if y'all got any questions in the comment section. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, I got an ebook out now, man. Step-by-step -step tutorial. Ebook is $5. Only $5 right now. When I drop part two, the price going to go up from the first one. So go ahead and get it right now. Get part one. You don't want to miss out on that. Go to my website. Scroll all the way down. Get the ebook. Buy it. And we lit, man. But that's it for this video. I'm out. Peace. Die.